What's up, ladies and gents? This is Casey Kid coming at you with another Destiny video. It's the weekend, so it's Trials of Osiris time. And I happen to have this little gem saved aside. It's a sick match. It's just Bravo, one of those matches where you're just like, I can't believe this happened. An 0 4 comeback. Opponents. That's great. It actually happened for us. So if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and smack that like button and subscribe to the channel. It seemed pretty fitting since Burning Shrine again is the map, and it is Celestial and Reverse that are in this together with myself. We're in this together. And over there, I've got the guy hit with the thorn. I didn't hit max damage, so you can see that's about the distance of the fall off of the thorn. And I kind of tried peeking out around here, threw out a scatter grenade, get a couple tags on that guy, but he dropped down. Now, with a few more shots out there, you can see we went ahead and took a lead. The orb is right here in front of us, and the enemy markers are around us too, so trying to make sure we hold the orb and don't let them get the revive, but of course they're right there. Now, what I should have been doing is swapping over to my shotgun. Just in replay and watching this little bit of film, I should have swapped over to the shotgun right there and tried to rush forward just a little bit to take an enemy down, because I was back out of shotgun range, but I was way too focused on aiming at that orb with the thorn, and it really hurt us, because I fell down to a shotgun. So they got into range, they shotgunned me, one shot, it was dead. My thorn shots did nothing, did nothing at all, especially through the overshield. Should have been on a shotgun there, and that could have helped us win that match. But we didn't, and that makes us in an 0-1 hole, and that's never a good thing. Not a good way to start things off, but of course here we go redeeming ourselves, and Celestial goes ahead and gets an enemy down with his sniper rifle. Over here it looks like there's somebody, I overshot my scatter grenade, poor reverse got shot down, and somehow that guy got full health. I guess... I don't know. I have no idea how he got full health though already. I guess he was already regaining health when he came back around the corner. I don't believe he was a void walker to where he would have the energy drain melee to regain his health, but when I came around the corner, he had full health. And again, another case where if I would have had a shotgun out, I could have taken him down. But I didn't. And that's an O2 hole now. So, not doing very well in the beginning. Then again, if you're going to have a comeback, you have to have a whole lot of bad to start off. Otherwise, there's nothing to come back from. <laughs> so I'm trying to do something, just anything, different. Just to not be in the same positions and be predictable. But I really hate where I'm at right now. I'm just in a spot where I can get flanked. And I really feel like I was thorn glitched there. I lost way too much health from one shot there. And the guy obviously had a follow shot right away. So it wasn't like he used the actual final round of the thorn right there. I really kind of feel like I was thorn glitched there. That was way too much damage from one shot. Way too much. But regardless, oh, three hole. And I never show the heavy rounds because we are typically awful, awful in doing the heavy rounds. And you'll get to see why. Oh, I hate the heavy rounds. In fact, the only thing I can say to do on the heavy rounds for myself is just rush after their heavy. Because the worst thing that can happen is we die and we die real quick. But we're going to die anyway. And right here, I'm kind of in the middle, avoiding that one rocket that went over my head, but I've got a trip mine grenade over to the side. We're tied one to one in this round. I shot way too low that rocket, and I got blasted in the back. Really bad, really bad. And of course, whenever you're down in the heavy round, you're in bad shape because the rockets, they come a flying. <laughs> they come flying all over the place. And there was a rocket back that got reversed. It got celestial. It was over. It was bad. It was bad. So after losing the heavy, it is now 0 to 4. And you can check out my stellar KD of 0. 0. <laughs> the only person who is having a decent match at all is Celestial. The rest of us are letting him down big time. 0. 0. <laughs> after 4 rounds. <laughs> oh my goodness. It's happening and it's terrible. So again, I'm shooting the thorn across the map and I'm really in that fall off range where my shots aren't doing max damage. I end up falling down and this guy, he's using Angel of Light on his Warlock and he's just floating up there right for the picking. And we ended up taking him down. I want to go over here and get the orb, but I missed. And I ended up seeing this guy on my second blink. He's over here. We can go ahead and throw out a scatter grenade. That didn't get him. Let's see if I learned. Yes, shotgun. 
Boom. All right. We died again, but there it is. Our first kill. Because I learned, switch over to the shotgun. You might need it, especially in close range. But of course, they ended up self-reviving, and the warlock is rushing around. We have the orbs both on our side, though, so that's a good thing. One orb down here and one up over here by the broken bridge. I have a scatter grenade that I'm going to go ahead and toss out. I got a bunch of tags out there, and Celestial ended up taking him down. So there we go. Our first win. Four to one. 4 to 1. At least we won. I killed something. <laughs> 0.17 KD for the win. <laughs> you know you're doing good when you got that 0.17 KD. <laughs> so again, over here, trying to just see where they're at. They really do like being down and shooting across this big opening. So seeing if Celestial can go ahead and get a shot out. We did get somebody down, Reverse got somebody down, and trying to peek out just a little bit, see if I can see any enemies, and there is a guy over here, and he's chasing Celestial, and he got a shotgun to the back. So I swap over to the shotgun, and suddenly now I've got two kills. I just doubled my KD in these last two rounds. You know, that whopping .33 KD. <laughs> Fear it. <laughs> so there it is. 4-2 win. Again, if you're on the team that's got 4 Match wins right point. now, Don't you're really not point. all that concerned. I mean, you are 1 win away from closing this out. We still have a long way to go, and they actually are kind of flanking us over onto the side, so I'm just backed up around this pillar to make sure that I don't get burned by the fireball grenade. I ended up taking an enemy down, and I'm rushing back because Celestia was like, hey, there's a sniper. Well... By rushing back, I ended up getting killed, but I think he feels bad and he's coming to revive me. I do have my sexy Nova Bomb out here. Oh my goodness, two guys right there. Two down. That's why I love me some Nova Bomb, some explosions. And that means we can go ahead and guard these orbs because both of them are together over here. I don't know where that final guy is, though, but if he does try to come over here to the orbs, I'll be able to see him on radar. It looks like he's in the middle a little bit. So I'm going to just kind of peek out over here and Celestial ended up tracking him down Enemy and taking him down. Eliminated. Right now, four to three match. So you got to start sweating just a little bit if you're on the opposing team because you were one win away from closing things out and now it's four to three. Match That's point. a little bit dicier. So I'm walking my way down here because again, they do like to challenge down at the bottom. But they seem to move around just a little bit too, so it's possible that they might go back up to the broken bridge. It does look like they are over there, so I'm kind of sneaking my way over here, and wow, that's going to do it. A celestial slam. I'm going to grab all these orbs. Look at me. Real close to super. Real, real close to super. And what we did was we tied things up. So momentum firmly, firmly on our side. It's a 4-4 match now. This one is for the win. This one is for all the marbles. Can we complete the comeback? Can we complete it? So again, the first challenge of the map comes down in this big open area. Reverse ends up falling down, but I want to wait and revive her as that barrier is coming up. But Celestial has his quick revive plate on, and he's able to get her. Looks like they're coming back around the broken bridge. Actually, no, they're coming down from the bottom, and potentially the broken bridge. Yes, I do see him on my radar to the left. I turn and go ahead and fire off some shots. There he goes. We got him down. Somebody's coming in for a revive. I toss out my Nova Bomb. That's it. Postmortem, we killed him, we made the comeback. 0 to 4 to a 5 4 victory, we did it. Unbelievable. And this was me with zero kills in the first four rounds. Zero kills in the four, first four rounds, and I ended up coming back with what was absolutely needed in the end. Those Nova Bombs, though. Those Nova Bombs, though. And we know I had zero kills in the beginning, so I ended up picking up seven whenever it mattered most. Whenever our backs were against the wall, I ended up getting seven kills, trying to help my teammates out. We want to get to that lighthouse. We want to get there. So anyway, guys and gals, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, smack that like button. Subscribe to the channel to keep updated on daily Destiny content. Check out these awesome videos. Good luck with your raids, your drops, your trials of Osiris, and I'll see you around in Destiny 5-4.